Turn. Hold up. Saver. So, this is our new guess. Good evening. My name is Shuji Ikutsuki. I'm the chairman of the board for your school. Ikutsuki. Hard to say, isn't it? That's why I don't like introducing myself. Even I get tongue-tied sometimes. Please, have a seat. I apologize for the confusion regarding your accommodations. But it may take a bit longer before you receive the proper room assignment. Is there anything you'd like to ask? You saw... something strange? Like what? You were probably just tired. I wouldn't worry about it. Any other questions? 
There are only four students in this dorm. You, Takeba-kun here, Kirijo-kun, and a third year named Akihiko Sanada-kun. I hope you all get along. Do you have another question? To welcome you, of course. You don't mind, do you? Speaking of which, Takeba-kun, have you seen Kirijo-kun by any chance? She's upstairs. As diligent as always. But it couldn't hurt to come down and say hello. Is there anything else? Excellent. Here's to a wonderful school year. Now, if you'll excuse me. I'm sure you're worn out from all these formalities. You may want to consider going to bed early. As they say, the early bird catches the bookworm. <laughs> Get it? Bookworm? <laughs> because you're students? Clever, isn't it? get used to his lame jokes. I guess I'll head back to my room, too. Like the chairman said, you should get some rest. Transferring schools is a real pain when you're not used to it. Good night. Hello there. So, how's he doing? He went to bed a little while ago. He's currently fast asleep. Mr. Chairman, do you think he's... Well, let's wait and see for now. The dark hour is approaching. Come on, what do you say? I can't leave a pretty girl standing around in the cold like this. Mm, what do you think, Miami? I mean, I'm cool with it, but if my parents found out... They don't need to know. Just drop him a text. It'll be fine. Yeah. Okay, let's do it. Uh, this sucks. <laughs> I'm serious. I was scared yeah, shitless. Right. Nice story, though. That was the Bayside Rockers, brought to you by KJ. And that's all for tonight, folks. Tune in again next week, same time, yeah, yeah. same place. The program you just heard was sponsored by Kirijo Electronics, bringing the future to you. The time is now 12 a.m. still sleeping. The dark hour occurs every day at 12 midnight. You could say it's the hidden hour. During this time, an ordinary person transmogrifies into a coffin and is oblivious to all that occurs. Then he must be... As you can see, he's retained his human form. He may be asleep, but he's definitely experiencing the dark hour. The only question that remains is whether or not he has the potential. Though, come to think of it, he must. Scary. In any case, we should continue to monitor him for a few more days. Yes, sir. I feel kind of bad, though, spying on him like this.
Welcome to the Velvet Room. My name is Igor. I am delighted to make your acquaintance. This is Elizabeth. She's a resident here, like myself. Pleased to meet you. This place exists between dream and reality, mind and matter. Only those who have signed the contract can enter this place. From now on, you shall be welcome here as a guest in the Velvet Room. You were destined to hone your unique ability, and you will require my assistance to do so. I only ask one thing in return. Abide by your contract, and assume full responsibility for the choices you make. on to this. Until we meet again.